very pleasant good evening ladies and gentlemen here we are on Jake's Row as you see world acclaimed artist Jimmy Stewart is putting the final touch on Amy Jake Scarvey today I'm honored honored because the maestro Jimmy Stewart is immortalizing the legend Amy Euphemia Jake Scarvey it is the brainchild of Frank Marshall, a 70-year-old man from the community who have always wanted to lord this great woman. She is our first lady. And when we immortalize her, all the children of the community will be able to see her and recognize that this woman is our hero. Come the 31st of December, she would have been 127 years old. The very first time her birthday will be celebrated. And what a beautiful day it will be to come that day. The morning of December 31st at 9 o'clock, we're going to be having a memorial service at the St. Andrew Parish Church. Remembering this great woman, remembering this great lady for the work that she has done, not just for Jamaica, but for all of Africa, those at home and those abroad. I am honored to be able to meet the caretaker, Everton Douglas, one who believed in the upliftment, the integrity of his community. To see that a woman of this magnitude is so honored. Then at four o'clock, we will be launching the Amy Jakes Garvey Community Center. What a timing it will be. 127 years old she would have been come December 31st. So we ask asking every single member of the Jakes Road community to come out. We're asking every member of Jam Jamaica if you can find the time to be at the St. Andrew Parish Church. Be there in your numbers and celebrate the life of a great, great, great woman. She's a woman responsible for compiling the philosophy and the opinion of Marcus Garvey. She's a woman responsible for writing the great book Garvey and Garveyism. She is responsible as a Pan-Africanist for helping Mr. Garvey in his troubled times. Even when he's in prison, she used to go and tour the United States of America, speaking on platforms all over, lauding Mr. Garvey and never taking away from the greatness of this man. So it is an honor for me to be a part of this great initiative to honor this great lady once and for all. You know what we're asking for Jamaica? We're asking that the order of distinction be bestowed upon Amy J. Garvey posthumously. She has never been awarded. The only thing that she got was a Musgrave Award. And we know what Musgrave is all about. So today, I am honored to be a part of history. Let's come out and celebrate the life of Amy Euphemia Jakes Garvey. What a woman, what a man, what a history. 